get engine multiple source and multiple sink now what is the multiple source we can have more than one source and we can have more than one sink but it is not compulsory that we have two source and two sink even we have two source and one sink is still a problem of what multiple source and multiple sink we have one source and two sink still a problem of what multiple source multiple sink or we can have any number of source on any number of sink we have a model of reversible heat engine that is a carnot model we have a source here i will just call this one as th1 th2 th3 so i have three sources from this one the heat supplied is qh1 the heat supplied to the heat engine is qh2 from this source we have qh3 i have two sink one at tl1 other at tl2 heat rejected by this one is ql and from this one is ql2 you can have any number of heat input any number of heat output but work is only one this model is called as heat engine with multiple source and multiple sink first law i am not writing sigma qvin and this i am applying law of conservation of energy summation of energy in equal to summation of energy out heat and work both are energy with respect to heat engine you have to give the sign convention is qh1 is it in qh1 is in is qh2 is in QH3 is in with reference to heat engine and how many out W is out QL1 is out and QL2 is out equation number 1 second law the second law i will prefer this one that is what sigma q by t equal to 0 so from second law if this is a reversible model then sigma q by equal to 0 when you write sigma q by t you have to write with respect to heat engine heat supplied is taken as positive heat rejected is taken as negative but only the ratio of heat by temperature no role of w so is it a positive quantity so plus q h1 by t h1 plus Q H two, T H two plus Q H three, T H three. What about Q L one? Minus sign because rejected. Q L one by T L one. Again minus Q L two divided by T L. equals to what zero what is the efficiency of heat engine so desired work is what desired output is what w so efficiency of heat engine is simply w divided by heat supply so heat supply is this quantity that is qh1 plus qh2 plus qh3 